The world today is remembering Burt Reynolds, a Hollywood icon whose name simply meant cool to a whole generation. But what many people don't know is that he was a great mentor to the next generation in Hollywood. So joining us live by phone to share his own personal experience, his own memories of the late legend is our dear friend, Scott Wolf. Hey, Scott. Yay. Hey, gang. How's everybody doing? We miss you, number <laughs> one. Uh, I'm I so miss you guys. Oh, well, we are very sorry for your loss. And your Instagram post, Scott, it, about Bert, it really moved me. So let me read to the DBL audience exactly or some of it of what you wrote. Out loud, he was one of the biggest stars we will ever know. Quietly, he was one of the most kind and generous. I count myself among the countless young artists he championed and believed in and supported and taught and went to bat for. So tell us more about that. Well, look, I, I um, you know, grew up with Burt Reynolds as as many of, of uh, my generation did and knew him as obviously a mammoth talent and an incredibly huge star, um, a larger than life figure. And what I came to know uh, uh, because I was lucky enough to, to meet him when I was uh, just starting out was that, um, you know, the, the sort of open secret about him was that he was a true champion of young talent and he just had it in his heart and spirit to, you know, when he, uh, when he saw somebody that he believed in, um, he, you know, he was just drawn to the idea of being a mentor and, and a guide. And um, so, you know, when he, uh, just at the beginnings of my career, uh, a guy who I lived in an apartment building with worked for Bert, and he said, oh, you got to meet him. And so what I came to know pretty quickly was that, you know, he had the Burt Reynolds Institute and theater down in, in Palm Beach in Florida. And the entire design of that institute theater was to teach acting and to mentor young artists. And so uh, that was something that he did out of his own heart, out of his own wallet. You know, he, he built that place from the ground up. And when I met him, he... Um, I don't know. You know, I, I feel like uh, he saw he saw something in me, and 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 he wound up asking to meet with me. And I went in and I sat when he was making the show Evening Shade. Uh, I went and sat. We had lunch in his office, and I spent about an hour with him, and had really what was an an unbelievably invaluable and generous conversation and meeting with him. And you know. Half the time, I was trying to, uh, you know, kind of keep my composure, and I believed in myself, and I thought, well, this is just another experience along my journey. <laughs> and the other half of me was like, this is for a rattle! <laughs> uh, and, and was just trying not to openly freak out in front of him. Oh, man. Uh, that is such a... Wound up, Go ahead. Well, he, yeah, he wound up uh, deciding to put me on that show. On wow. his show. And he called the writers into the room and he said, I believe in this kid and, and uh, I wanted to play this role. And, uh, and so I wound up having not only been, you know, sort of blessed by uh, his grace and generosity and kindness in terms of meeting with me, but he literally put me to work and gave me one of my first big breaks. And, and, and like I said in that Instagram post, there are countless young actors and, and writers and directors that were lucky enough to know Bert and to be, um, you know, to, to, to have gone through his institute or just been granted some kindness or generosity or mentorship through him. And, 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 and you know, he didn't, he didn't go yelling about it. You know, it was something that was a huge part of his life, um, but that he didn't, you know, he didn't look for credit from it. It was just something that was in his spirit to do. And, and so... Losing him yesterday was was uh, was a deeply sad experience. I think for everyone who's been a fan of his, uh, and there's millions and millions of people who have, but for anyone whose life was directly touched by him and his generosity, it was especially hard to hear. Oh man! Well, thank you for sharing that remarkable story, and we hope to see you soon, Scott. I can't wait to see you guys next. Thanks for having me. Bye, Scott.